the Final Cut Pro title bug and how to avoid it. Okay, so uh, you may have just actually seen the bug that I want to talk about today. And that is the video starting with the word title. So let me show you again, just in case you've missed it. Okay, did you see it? Uh, let me try again with uh, slow motion. Okay, so there it was. And the effect that you see is that the very first frame of the video is showing basically the thumbnail of the title when you pick as you pick it from uh, Final Cut Pro, right? So in this in this case, this was made with uh, pixie dust, and as I've seen the same thing here happening with horizontal blur. But now let me show you how I am able to reproduce this. And I'm doing this the following way. I have here this little example project just with a really short clip. And I am adding here in this case the horizontal blur. And I'm starting this title right at the zero mark. And then just as usual, I'm going to rename my title here. And let's see, just with my example here, my horizontal blur example. And so now, as soon as you start playing this, it should just show the title. But as soon as I now pull this cross dissolve transition over this, I am getting into trouble. So for some reason, exactly this order is going to create the bug that you've seen here before. But this also only happens if I'm using compressor to create the video. So if I'm just using or compressing inside of Final Cut Pro itself, nothing happens or it just works normally. But as soon as I do this here with compressor, we are going to see the issue that I've shown you in the beginning. So now, how do I avoid this bug with the title being shown in the beginning? And that is pretty easy. And all I have to do that works for me is I just pick the, uh, the title and I'm going to move this away from the zero mark here. And that's going to move it over just a couple of milliseconds. And just having this gap in place will cause the title to work properly. Okay, so uh, well, let me just check here show you really quick which uh, versions I'm using here. So I'm using Final Cut Pro version 10.4 and I've seen this uh, in prior versions also. So this is not a new issue. And then I am using that together with Compressor 4.4. All right. Yeah. Okay. So I hope this video was helpful. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, then uh, please write a comment below.